Oh, guys, check that out. These already grew. Oh, it's been a long time. Actually, let's just... Bam. I don't need all these. It's been a long time. Do I just cut down the tree and it gives me the rubber? Let's find out. I know a way to find out. It's just getting ready to go down to the nether. Gathering up whole bunches of, uh... No. Didn't give me... Empty booze barrel. Jeez. Chase. This is just wood. Wait. Extractor. Oh, for God's sake. Really? Tree tap. Really? You're not even you're not even gonna give me planks, friend? That's you gonna play it like that, huh? It's a little it's a little rude. It's like that. Tree tap. I think they're supposed to appear like on the on the bark, right? And you just knock them off with the tree tap? I don't wanna have to build another machine. Yeah, here we go. Like this. Yeah, okay. Phew. But but is it What's that? What the heck? Friends, what the heck? I ask you, what the heck? Where did it go? So should I just let these... There we go, I got that one. That was so weird. I'm glad I'm recording this. I'm glad I have proof. <laughs> I think I just leave these and they grow back, right? And then I just throw that in the furnace. And I get the rubbers. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Cool. At least that part is not going to be too bad. Yeah, they do come back. They do come back. Oh, that is such good news, you guys. That is such good news. That is one giant pain that I thought I was going to have to go through. And it looks like I don't after all. So few to that is what I say. Few. Gives me several there. Okay, I do still need to go to the nether, though, whether I like it or not. And I need to go and try to spawn in one of these slimes. Ooh, tell you what, guys. Didn't mean to bring in that axe. Let's leave that there, shall we? Okay, so what I'm going to do, basically, is I'm just going to expand this platform that I made. Got lots and lots of cobblestone. Uh, I did bring this stone pickaxe. I should have made a better one, but I didn't. So that's the end of that, I guess. Um, yeah, so it needs to be higher. So I've got to raise... i got to raise the roof. Roof needs to be raised. Um, but I don't have to raise it high enough for uh, Enderman to spawn. I just need to raise it another half block. Very important information to have, you guys. If you have it three high, then Endermen can spawn, and they are a pain in the bottom. But, you can avoid that. By making it, uh, two and a half blocks tall, instead of three. I am also going to want to make it wider, so this is going to be... I'm just going to make it a bigger platform in general. But this time I'm not hunting the pigmen. So I don't necessarily need to worry. Oh, look at that. You can see student's little box over there. Not as fancy as mine. I'm going to go ahead and say it. Mine is fancier. I know it doesn't necessarily need, need to be fancy, but still. Mine is fancier is all I'm saying. Yeah, that looks like a good size platform, I think. We'll take these. No sense in wasting them. Give me those, thank you very much. So, now... Probably don't actually need to put a railing around this high, but... I'm doing it anyway. I appear to be doing it anyway. Okay. So we've got one, two, and a half tall. Now what I need to do, and it's a little bit of a pain, but in order to do it safely, um, 
I need to put one here so that this is one, one, two and a half tall. But this is the top half of the tile, which means it's spawnable territory. So I'm also going to have to put another layer on the top if I want to make sure nothing spawns on the roof. Again, bit of a pain, but not the end of the world. It's doable. Oof. So yeah, if I hit the, uh, the old S7, as you can see... Oops. No, 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 no. We're not, we're not doing that. This is all spawnable, spawnable territory. So now I need to do this. Holding shift to live, obviously. Very concerned about that. There we go. Sweet. So this is all taken care of. The only spawnable tiles now uh, are these ones, which again are too close to the portal. I'll never be far enough away. And then the rest of these are spawnable and hopefully, hopefully, before too, too long, I will get some, uh, just gonna go ahead and throw some trap doors on here. So that I have an easy way across later without making myself susceptible. So hopefully I'll get some magma cubes before too long. I'm just gonna hang out over here and wait and see, see what happens. All right, I got my first round of spawns in here, as you can see. There is actually a, a, a magma cube, but it's a small one. The tiny ones don't give you the things. There's also... One of these guys has already walked off the edge. Like an idiot. I'm gonna go ahead and kill these guys. Ooh, gotta be careful. There's so many of them. Whoa, bit of lag. <laughs> it's a little creepy. I'm trying to get this. There we go, I'll get that guy. Uh, whoa! Hey, 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 hey! Listen, friends! Don't jump on each other's heads. That's against the rules. Oh my goodness. The anger of these pigmen. It's palpable. The sound they make. Squeal! Alright, have to come down and kill the rest of these guys over here. So, I'm afraid... Come on. I'm afraid it's probably gonna take a little while for me to get a magma cream. To get a, a big enough cube. And remember, even when you get a big enough cube, not necessarily going to drop the cream. Get all of this good stuff. Go on to the next round. I will eat that. Because as we have discussed, delicious and nutritious. Look at this, I got a full, a full gold bar. Full bars I got. Ugh. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. You guys, this is what happens when people don't put roofs over the things. You get gas spawning in the nether when uh, we're not necessarily prepared to deal with ghasts. You guys want to come over here so I can punch you, please? Oh, man. I mean, there's going to come a point where we want ghasts, but now is not that point. I am in no way prepared for a ghast right now. Go away, ghast. Please do not come here. I don't want you here. I'm still not gonna be able to reach this guy. I guess I'll go back. Oh man, that stinks. Um, folks, if you're playing with other people on a server, make sure that you put a roof over even your walkway, or put your walkway down at the bottom half of the block like I did, because uh, when other people are in the Nether, your area is gonna be loading in monsters. Guys, will you please come here? Can you come here, please? Please? Can you please come here? Haven't gotten any more uh, Mammy Cubes, not even the tiny ones. Been doing this for a little while. I Honestly, it does kind of feel like I'm wasting time at this point. I mean, I could set up an automated system to do it, but I, f I feel like that would take even longer. Like, I hope that this isn't going to take that long. Guys, come here. Look at these beautiful, uh, these beautiful trap doors here. They look like you could probably, they could probably bear your weight even though they're open. Come here. I'm gonna, come here. Uh, oh, he's just out of reach. Dang it. I don't want to go over there because they will kill me. There's too many of them. Dang it. 
just gonna have to wait until something spawns in closer or one of them wanders off the edge there. <sighs> this is probably my least favorite part of the pack. And I feel like there must be another way to do this, you know? I feel like there's gotta be... Did you come close enough? Oh, somebody came close. Somebody came close. I feel like there's gotta be another way. Rather than having to hunt for magma cream. Oh, one of these guys is gonna get me. Oh my goodness! There sure is a lot of you, friends. Line up in a nice orderly fashion, please. My sword's almost broken. Fortunately, these guys are dropping a lot of their golden swords. And I've been putting them back together. So once this iron one breaks, I won't have to go back. Yep. Like that. I know the the gold ones don't have much durability, but they do hit hard. Check this out, you guys. Check this out. I'm grabbing this stuff. Grab all these goodies. Look at this. Got a whole golden sword right here. And a tiny sliver of one as well. Because why not? Alright, folks, I'll tell you what, I, um, I do see there's a magma cream, a magma slime over there, but they're little tiny ones, little tiny babies. Um, I do feel like this is going to take too long, and I am wasting precious, precious time. So I think what I am going to do, hello, is, um, I'm going to go back, and I'm going to make, yes, hello, little, little slimy friends. And these, these gold swords, by the way, so not worth it. Anything. <laughs> better off. I'm better off with a stone sword than a gold one, my goodness. At least they last a little while. Come on. Take care of these guys. Um, I'm gonna have to go and kill the magma slimes in person, I think. I think there's just one of them left. Hello, little friend. You're dead now. I wish that you would drop the magma cream, but you will not. That is an established fact. So I think what I'm going to go ahead and do, guys, is um, I'm going to go and get some of those iron spikes. And I'm just going to line the bottom of that pit with iron spikes just to save a little bit of time. And I don't know. I mean, I could set up some fans and, and just create like an automated mob system in here like I did uh, in the overworld. But it's just such a pain. I keep hoping like surely a big one will spawn any moment now, right? I am sure that they can spawn in here, because this is the size that I made it last time, and it worked eventually. It's just that they spawn so rarely. Ugh. I keep saying, guys, I keep- oh, crap. Ah, oh, crap. Crap! Ah, oh, first death. Ugh. <sighs> Yeah, folks, I keep saying I need to just build an automated system, and then I, like, just keep staying there, holding on to hope. Um, yeah, I need to build an automated system, guys. <laughs> I need to build a, a mob farm down there, because that's... It's not working out at all well for me. Um, yeah. I, like, I, I keep... Just wasting my time, I think. And, uh, that's an issue. I think I'm also losing my mind a little bit. Because I can't remember what I'm doing at any moment <laughs> during this entire thing. So, actually, I think instead of racing back there... Well, I suppose I should go back and get my stuff. Although, to be honest, what did I even have? I didn't really have anything down there. The only precious thing I had was that axe, and I put that away. Alright, I'm gonna go back and get my stuff. Just before it despawns, because there's no gravestones. If there were gravestones, I wouldn't even do this. I'm gonna go get my stuff, and then I'm gonna prepare the things that I need to just make an automated mob system in the nether. It's not that hard. I don't know why I've been trying to avoid doing it. I guess I was hoping that this would just be a quick, like, jump in there, spawn the thing, kill it, get back to work kind of situation, but it's just not working out that way. So... You know, it's a skyblock pack. It's a skyblock pack. You're supposed to automate stuff. You're supposed to get machines to do things for you so you don't have to do them. What am I trying to do things by hand for? I've been doing so well and I've just lost like... 45 minutes or something? To this? This dumb old project? That's not worth it. Are they- they're gone? Okay, they've despawned. All my stuff. 
Yeah, none of this is really worth coming back for. <laughs> well, maybe the feather. There was a feather. There it is. Feathers are useful. Alright, so yeah, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just head back up. And uh, I'll come back down prepared to make a proper mob system. Like a proper skyblock player. Man, I'm so bummed that I so stupidly got myself killed. <laughs> Student had died once already. And I was like, haha, he died once and I haven't died. And then I went and freaking died. Like an idiot. Like an idiot! What kind of idiot gets themselves killed in a skyblock map, huh? <sighs> Very disappointed in you, Ira. Very disappointed indeed. Oh, this is more like it. Oh my goodness, you guys, you wouldn't believe I spent all this time setting this up, and then I went in and loaded the chunks, and then I was coming down here just to check on things. Right here. Oh, there's another one. There was already a magma cream in there. <laughs> I guess um, I should have done this in the first place. I probably wasted a good maybe hour and a half first trying to just uh, get a magma cream to spawn in and kill it manually. Why is that one? Oh, there's a dead spot there. Oops. There we go. Anyway, um, yeah, as soon as I had loaded the chunks in, basically, I got my first magma cream, and now I have two. So, got all we need, finally. I have uh, unloaded the chunks in here, because we don't need this running all the time, and it's time to head back. See you guys up there. Oh boy. May have done a, uh, a slight derp, and left this thing running and chunk loaded the whole time. Oh, feathers. Uh, this is not in any way automated. I didn't actually mean to leave it on for that long. I just forgot to come and shut it down. Whoops, whoops, whoops. Whoops. Anyway, got my magma cream. Um, I will have to set this up to uh, automatically collect and put everything in drawers. I obviously need some storage upgrades for these drawers. This is full, but that's okay because this thing just runs out of energy. It's not even full. And as you may have noticed, we got piggies. Hello, piggies. Oh my goodness, and we have donkeys. Hello, donkeys. Aw. I could use some chickens, actually, but all right. You guys are cute. Oh, I didn't put a fence. Oh, goodness. All right, I got to build a fence. Um, I'm just going to quickly make some... Um, let's just make some redstone lamps. Probably going to need the crafting grid. Redstone lamp. Just to uh, put a shutdown switch. On this here. Thingam thingamabobber. Thingam thingamajugger. Um, I left my axe in the nether. Crap. You guys know what? I'm probably just going to end up. Probably going to end up leaving it there. I don't want to go all the way back down the water. Because <laughs> remember, I thought I was being so clever. Probably don't even need this one. There we go. We've got two. Sweet. All right. Back to work. Oh, no. First thing, I'm going to make a fence. Okay. I've got a simple little fence. Doesn't even go the whole way around. But it should be enough to keep the donkeys in there. Um, seem to have lost the pigs. Not sure what happened to them. It has been a while, guys. Uh, last little bit just before this was from quite a while ago. Uh, I have just now finished editing all the footage up to this point. So... Yeah. It's been... Maybe a couple of weeks since I've been on here. I decided to start putting out another dirt level here. And I'm going to have to go down and extend the the level underneath as well. So that I can get underneath and put another level under the dirt. So that I can make holes for water and stuff. Because this is obnoxious. This isn't going to stay here. This isn't going to stay here. These were just temporary measures. Uh, so I'm just making some dirt now. It's it's slow going because it's also... I can actually can take the cobble off. I will leave coal on there. I can take the iron off. Just throw these over here. Speed that up a little bit. Um, okay, so I gotta take stock of where I was. And guys, friends, friends, friends. Um, some of you may have been watching the last couple episodes going, what, 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 what is she, what is she doing? What, why is she, what, Ira, what are you, what, 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 what is, what? Like that, for just the whole time. Um, 
I, I, I done derped up a little harder than I even realized, friends. I must have spent maybe two hours in the nether trying to, trying to get that magma cream, which I do now have. Uh, if you remember, the reason I wanted magma cream was to get blaze powder to make the blast furnace from immersive engineering so that I wouldn't have to do the IC2 one. To make the blast brick, I need bricks, I need blaze powder, which I can get from the magma cream, and I need nether brick. And I said I can make the nether brick, and then once I have uh, four pieces of nether brick is all I can make with my one bucket of lava, then I can turn them into a, a brick block, and then I can duplicate the brick blocks. And that is true. However, to get the nether brick out from the brick blocks, guys, I have to pulverize the nether brick blocks, which means building a pulverizer, which is another machine. I am making this so much more complicated, guys. Um, I'm much better off just biting the bullet and making the IC2 blast furnace. I mean, it's a pain. There's no question about that. It's actually not that much of a pain compared to the other ones. Just need a bunch of rubber, copper, iron, um, and a power source, but I already need to get a power source for IC2 because I need to use IC2 machines for everything else in this part. So it's possible, guys. What am I doing? It's possible that I have just wasted several hours. I will eventually need blaze powder for something. Um, however, I think by then I will have another way of getting it. And so it was not at all necessary to go magma slime farming. That was not necessary at all. Start to finish, waste of time, waste of several hours. Now the others who have been playing on the server who are way ahead of me at this point because they are uh, mostly not recording. I think Paint Eagle is recording. You should go check, check out his videos if you're looking for another perspective on this little race. Um, but, uh, the others, Jar of Jam and X student are just playing. They're not worried about recording stuff. And I think they are basically... There we go. No! Oh well. Goodbye. I think they're basically done. Uh, X student is done. He's done. Let's, let's take a look. Let's take a look at the leaderboards, guys. Uh, student is done. 18 hours, 16 minutes, 53 seconds. That's the time to beat. Jar of the Gems. Jar of Jam is, um ahead of me, quite a bit ahead of me, and he hasn't played that much longer than me. Uh, Paint Eagle has played slightly longer than me, and I'm actually not sure where he's in relation to me at this moment, but I know he has some trouble at the start, so I might still be ahead of him, but I'm not sure. And there's me, and I'm just lagging behind, derping up, der derping up a storm. I just, like, I kind of want to just start over. <laughs> I just want to start over. I want to start this whole dang thing over with again. Um, and do it right. There's so many things that I would do differently now after this, after this first experience. And, well, I can't. Too bad. Too bad, Ira. You, you, you derped up and now you gotta own it. You gotta deal with it. So we need to, we need to do the IC2 stuff. We need to do the IC2 stuff. The thing that I need to make is the induction furnace. Yeah, this one right here. Not this one, if only. Uh, and for that, I need the advanced machine casing which is all kinds of fun stuff. The advanced alloy, mixed metal ingot. I have these. I think I have the mixed metal ingots, right? I do. Mixed metal ingot. Check. Okay. Next thing down the line. Carbon plate. Uh, raw carbon mesh. Raw carbon. Blah, 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 blah. Pulverized. Okay. To make the pulverized coal, I can use a redstone furnace. No, nuts on coal dust. Pulverizer. I can make a pulverizer. Okay, I don't... No, I have to, Okay, I can use thermal expansion. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. So we need a redstone reception coil. I may even have... I, sh I need to make, like, a, just a general tech chest. Can't remember what I already made and what I didn't make yet. Throw the magma cream in there. Don't need that for now. I will use it eventually, but I don't need it right now. What am I looking for? It's been too long, guys. Don't do not do a speed run and then stop in the middle of it. Oops. There we go. And then come back later and try to remember what you're doing, guys. It's 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 rough. It's rough. Um, oh my goodness. What, what was it that I needed? <laughs> Pulverized coal. Uh, pulverizer. Pulverizer is what I need. Uh, two copper gears. Machine frame. Tin gear, four iron, four glass. I think I still got a bunch of glass left. Let me drop this off for now. I only have one glass. Is that all I have? Did I not make any more glass? Well, shucks. Let's make a new... Let's make a new furnace. 
specifically for glass. I probably could just make like a redstone furnace, but eh. Okay. Well. Okay. Um, what else do I need for the pulverizer? Oop. Two copper gears, right? That's easy, easy peasy as well. I think some lemons are getting uh, squeezied up. Kaboom. Actually, I think I can do iron instead. Yeah, that's a little bit cheaper. I have I have more iron to spare. Okay, so we need this, this. Um, I need flint, don't I? Can flint... I have some gravel. I said I didn't think I was going to need any more. Um, I did realize uh, after, by the way, after the last one, that there is a crafting recipe for gravel, or for uh, flint. You just go like that. Let's see. I don't think flint can be duplicated, though. I think I have to duplicate the gravel and then craft it from there. I do have enough now. We'll just give that a second. Make... Great, because I put it here. Oh my gosh, you guys. The derpage is real today. The derpage is very, very real. Okay. Um, ooh. Good thing I have this chest, huh? Remember what I was just saying about Durbridge? Anyway, I need two of these. Got them. Um, all right, tin gear. Four pieces of tin, I think. That's all I need. I said four. Oh, that was... Oh, lag. Lag, my old nemesis. Good to see you again. Good to see you again, pal. Surely I must have enough glass now. Yep, yep, yep. Should be like uh, this. And like that, and like this, and, um, piston. Boom. So now I should be able to make the pulverizer. Perfect. Okay. I'm just going to throw this down right here. Obviously, I really need to move all the machines to another place, but for now, I'm trying to make up for lost time. I have lost so much time. It is pathetic. It is sh shameful. I am, I am tremendously ashamed. I promise you guys, if it brings you any solace. I am very, very ashamed. Um, I don't think I need that much. So I need pulverized coal. Okay, so now let's get back to the production furnace. I wish you could like bookmark recipes. Two carbon plates, which is two raw carbon matches. So I need four raw carbon fibers, which means I only need eight pulverized coal. That is actually not much. So even do that. Okay, so that's that while well, that's working. What else? What else? Steel plate. Right, so I need to make the blast furnace. I need to make the IC2 blast furnace because it would just be way too much work to make the... These are the easiest part. I need... Each one of those makes two. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I need four... Grab this hammer. Hammer. I know I'm going to need tons and tons of these, but... Okay. Uh, I have a feeling this one's going to be more complicated. Oh, no. Three copper, six plastic. That's actually not that bad. Uh, rubber, not plastic. I should have just made plastic, and I know it, and I'm kicking myself again. Because I will need the plastic later. If I can use the plastic now, like if I'm trying to save time, I should be doing stuff... Like, if I'm going to need something else later, I should just do it now. Instead of trying to avoid it. Okay, so we've got this. This this is it, guys. This is the blast furnace. This is all I needed to do. Of course, there's a little more to it because I can't just hook this up to normal power as far as I know. Let me double check that before I make a fool of myself yet again. You guys have seen me make a fool of myself enough times. Yeah, no. No. This needs other stuff. Okay, so... Wait, wait, wait. Is this the one where I need to use the special, the special industrial craft? Oh my god. I think I need to use the special industrial craft, uh, wrench. This one. Otherwise, it will break. Bronze. Did I make one already? Let's go check. Bronze is pretty easy. That's not a difficult thing to make. But, it gives you no warning. Put that back in there. These over here. 
Did I make one? I did not. There's iron in here. I could take that out. This all needs to be sorted out. 